Hi, today we're going to walk you through how to set up the VSOL OLT with WLAN in a quick and easy way. Let's begin. As usual log into the VSOL OLT by entering username and password. Then click login. Once you've got Alt Dashboard, click Root and IP. Then on VLAN IP enter in VLAN IP address. And Subnet Mask. Then click Submit. Next move to Static Root. On Static Root, enter in Destination IP as 0.0.0.0 and same as on Destination Mask. Then enter an IP address on the gateway. Click Add. Again, move to Root and click Save. Next click OLT Configuration and Uplink Port, follow Select Configuration, then disable the Isolate on each port. Then click Submit. Then move to VLAN and create a new VLAN ID. Here I created 5 VLAN IDs. After creating VLAN IDs move to VLAN port Select created VLAN IDs and make port tag and untag as I display it here. Like first VLAN ID tagging, make it for other 4 VLAN IDs. Once you complete the tag and untag of VLAN, you can see here a port table of VLAN enabled. Next, click uplink port and change the port speed as you want here. I changed 1000M full to the port ID G1 and 10G default for the other ports IDs. After that, click the PON and configuration tab. Here change the PVID to each PON port. And click Submit. Then move to the Uplink port and Configuration tab. Now change PVID to the concerned port as I shown. Then click Submit. 
Next move to VLAN and VLAN port. Here make a change of tag and untag to the VLAN ID, then click Submit. And change it for other four VLAN IDs too. Afterwards change the port speed as we did before, for that click uplink port and configuration, and change the speed to auto to port GE2. Then click submit. Next on system configuration, move to user management, and enter the username and password. along with confirmation. And set user role as admin, then click add to set. Once it done, click save. Then on system time, go to NTP and enable NTP, set time zone as of your location if needed. Daylight saving time. And enter master NTP server then click submit. Next move to login management. Then change action as permit. And enter the source IP and IP mask, then click add. Now it added on the access list. If you need to delete the protocol just click delete icon on the end of list. And for adding other protocols select protocol and others as we did it before. And one more, don't forget to save each setup. That's it, now the VSAL OLT setup has done. Thanks for watching. To see more videos like this, click the subscribe button below with the bell icon.